problem with current flash patterns is, is that they're too harsh on your eyes at night. The chaos, the attention grabbing, it's good for getting people out of your way, it's just when you arrive at the scene is when you want to shift it into a calmer mode. Dynamic variable intensity patterns are much softer and easier on the eyes essentially, so you never have it truly going off. You have it going from high points to low points. It's cool because it looks like you almost, like the vehicle went into a slow-mo all of a sudden, like everything's like It's slowly building up and going down. And so your eyes have time to adjust to it. You don't find yourself going like this when you're driving by. You're not getting blinded by the chaos of the lights. Looked at other testing that showed that people tend to stare at bright, dazzling lights. There's other studies in addition to that that say that impaired or slightly impaired drivers tend to drive where they're looking. So you put the two together and you've got drunk drivers driving into the back of emergency vehicles, okay, because of bright, dazzling lights. And their thought was, well, we need a, we need a proper response sort of flash pattern and intensity, and we need a proper flash pattern intensity when this vehicle is stopped at night.